for regular tech updates about different gadgets please subscribe to the channel and also click the bell icon so that you will be notified for every new video Hi friends welcome back to Gadgets India I am your host Siki and today I am going to share the unboxing and the review of two compact mini keyboards which you can avail in the market if you are in a need of a small compact keyboard and you want to use it on a day to day activity. So I have two different varieties of mini compact keyboards previously also I have done the unboxing and shared the review of the best keyboard under a price of 1000 rupees if you have missed that one please click the link above and you can find there now coming back to these two one is not having any kind of name or brand name on the pack it is just a gray box and the other one is having the name mentioned as ri real internet idea multifunction wireless keyboard so we'll go ahead with this one first and then we'll come back to the second one the packing is very basic this one is available on AliExpress at a price of 1000 rupees. This is a Bluetooth enabled keyboard. This is what the pack looks like. This is the keyboard which is a foldable keyboard. You see here this is a foldable keyboard. Beneath that we get the user manual. And this USB to micro USB charge cable to charge this device. Coming to this keyboard, this is made up of metal and uh, it's not very heavy, it's very uh, light, compact. As you see, it fits in between my palms nicely, light. You can carry it in your bag anywhere you travel. Now, in terms of the features, it also has a trackpad here, and uh, the trackpad is a small trackpad. There are three indicators. The first one is for the power, the battery level. The second one is for the Bluetooth connection level and the third one is for the caps lock indicator. And the keyboard is having the chiclet keys and uh, the travel is good. I think it is 1.6 mm of travel. There are two space bars and uh, you can use it ergonomically even if you are using your left thumb so you can use the space bar here also and uh, the key travel is good all the other functions like dedicated control for function or play pause brightness increase decrease all those things are there on the top side you see there is the on off switch you can press to right side to switch it on this button to press the bluetooth mode on so that it will be discovered in your uh, laptop or in your uh, smartphone whichever device you are using with and this is the micro usb charge point to charge this device now let me go to the second one this second keyboard is from rii this is real internet idea is the name of the company the retake and uh, this one is multifunction wireless keyboard and the packing is a little bit premium as compared to the previous one and uh, let's do the unboxing So we get this unique charge cable which is having micro USB point at one end and the other end is having USB male and female function. So this is a, a cable which you can charge this one and also you can connect the adapter. Then there is the user manual and there is this welcome leaflet and here is the keyboard. This is the keyboard from Retake. Compared to the previous one, it is small in dimension, but it can be folded. It is uh, light, both are of uh, equal width, but this is comparatively uh, lighter. And uh, here on this side, you see there is the power on off switch. So this one is to on, left turn is on, and then off. This point is to charge with micro USB charge cable. On this side, this is a trackpad. There are indicators. There are three different indicators. And here, the keys are not chiclet style. The keys are 
normal keys but uh, i feel it is very clumsy to type these keys because there is a very less distance between two keys so accidentally it will be there that you can press or you may end up pressing some other keys or nearby keys so it will take a little bit of hang of yours on the long run to get it used to on the back side with this flap there is this dongle to connect it it doesn't have bluetooth mode it has to be connected via this dongle so as you see these two are very compact in terms of their dimensions and they are also having the function of the trackpad the previous one the first one is having a smaller trackpad the second one the retake is having a bigger trackpad and to use there is no left right click here in both these there are no left or right click so how to use it so on a single tap it will be left click on double tap it will be right click and this is in both the keyboards now let me connect it one by one and let me share what is the response in terms of all the keys now i have connected this keyboard to my surface pro 4 and uh, as you see i'm able to use the trackpad and on single click it is the left click and on double tap this is the right click and it's working absolutely fine the trackpad is doing good but i'll say there is a little, little bit of lag in the trackpad sensor and uh, the sensors are not very good or as compared to the surface pro original keyboard the trackpad travel is not that good but in terms of the keys these are okay now let me just do some typing Now I am trying to do some typing over here. So you see there is uh, some issue in terms of uh, getting the keys uh, tapped. So while I am typing for one key, uh, the nearby keys are getting uh, typed. So that is getting some issue but uh, once you will start getting used to this device or this keyboard you will get the hang of it and you will also get used to with this uh, keyboard without pressing the unnecessary keys. Now in terms of uh, uh, the controls you can also stop or activate the keypad particularly this key by pressing this button. So this can be there to stop uh, or activate the keypad trackpad particularly now in terms of the indicators there are three indicators the extreme right one is the indicator to show the connection status whether it is connected to the dongle or not the middle one is for the caps lock so on the press of the caps lock this is getting green and the extreme left one is to get it uh, connected to the power source to charge it and once it is charged it will show red now in terms of the weight and in terms of the durability it's uh, made up of uh, aluminium and it's uh, working good now i'll get back to the second one now this keyboard is not having any dongle to be connected to your uh, laptop or your tablet so instead it works with bluetooth now you need to press this bluetooth source button on here it shows bluetooth 3.0 keyboard so this is what it shows in your uh, laptop or your surface pro 4 or other devices now once it is connected you can start using as a normal keypad here the beautiful part of this keyboard is that there is no uh, clumsiness in this keyboard and due to the chiclet size keys so there is a, a decent key travel and it feels good to do the typing for example So you can use this caps lock so now let me show you what are the buttons over here so this one is the caps lock so the indicator here the bottom one with the caps lock this one to indicate the bluetooth and this one is to indicate the charging status and here there is one more dedicated button to control so you can use it for multiple purpose and uh, there is one command button you can use to open your windows so this is the command button to open your in windows and uh, there is page up page down the control for volume up down play pause 
so all these are there also and you can uh, use this in, in any way possible because this is a very compact keyboard if you are going to buy a compact mini keyboard I'll suggest to go for any of these two keyboards but if you want to ask me with the best one then I'll suggest this mini Bluetooth 3.0 keyboard because it functions with Bluetooth support and that the trackpad is more responsive the keys are well spaced between each other and also the key travel is good due to the chiclet size design but on the other hand this retake is uh, not bad that bad at all what i'll say the key uh, are little bit of uh, tightly spaced and uh, uh, there is a, a chance that you can press uh, the adjacent key while pressing one key but you will get used to on a longer run but the trackpad is not very responsive one good part of this one that this lasts longer the battery life of this one is longer as compared to the bluetooth keyboard and uh, it has also the usb dongle so there is no need to uh, have bluetooth in your device so without bluetooth you can connect to your laptop or your surface pro 4 and you can play it but this bluetooth enabled keyboard you can use it with your mobile devices you can use it with your tablet and it will be a multi-function use or multi-purpose use keyboard thanks for watching this episode of gadgets india for more of such episodes please do like comment share and subscribe to the channel and while subscribing please press the bell icon so that you will be notified for every new video we upload have a good day